Pona Eclavata. Giant tropical bullet ants ranked highest on the Schmidt Pain Index. They're here to keep an eye on you and I can't. Who are you? Have you been standing there watching me sleep this whole time? Yes. Why? Because the last time you were here, you stole something. Oh. I speak to them. I can go anywhere, hear anything, and see everything. And still know absolutely nothing. <laughs> Useless. Show me. Terrible. You want to show me how to punch? Show me. That's how you punch. All right, princess. Let's get back to work. Were you going for the hand? Hope trained in martial arts at a uh, difficult time. Oh, by difficult time, he means when my mother died. We lost her in a plane crash. It's bad enough you won't tell me how she died. Could you please stop telling me that lie? We're working here. You have to commit. You have to mean it. No shortcuts, no lies. <sighs> Throwing insults into the mix will not do anyone any good, Hope. We don't have time for coddling. Our focus should be on helping Scott. Really? Is that where our focus should be? Hey, doesn't look like anyone's home. Anthony, get me to the roof. He's gonna lose his suit. He's gonna lose his life. Board now. It's okay. He can't see me. I can see you. He can see me. Hi. I'm Scott. Did he just say, hi, I'm Scott? <sighs> oh, God. You gotta lock your doors. I mean, really. There's some weird folks in this neighborhood. Do you think this is a joke? We're all doing this for reasons much bigger than any one of us. I'm just glad that you might have a slight chance of maybe pulling this off. Hey, thank you, you know, for that pep talk. You know, the honest truth is I actually went from despising you to almost liking you. You, you really should write poetry. <laughs> Do you have any idea what he's asking you to risk? You have a daughter. I'm doing this for her. You know when my mother died? I didn't see him for two weeks. He was in grief. Yeah, so was I, and I was seven. And he never came back, not in any way that counted. He just sent me off to boarding school. You know, I thought, with all that's at stake, just maybe we might have a chance of making peace. But even now, he still wants to shut me out. You know? Lang. Right, 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 right. So anyway, this guy gets out of jail and he starts working for Hank. That's when he met Hope. And Hope's all like, I want nothing to do with you. Look at my hair, dude. I'm all business. And then Scotty's like, you know what, girl? My heart is all broken and I'll probably never find love again. But damn if I want to kiss you. But then you fast forward and they're all like into each other, right? And then Scotty's like, you know what? I can't tell you this, but I'm going to go trash an airport with Captain America. And then she said, I can't believe you split like that. Smell you later, dummy. He's programmed to replicate your daily routine. Nine hours in bed, five hours in front of the TV, two hours in the bathroom, whatever that's about. That's totally inaccurate. And how do you know about my daily routine? Are you spying on me? We keep tabs on all security threats, all right? And so far, the biggest one we've had is you. Thank you, Sonny, really. But my father and I have something slightly more pressing than starting a business. So I'll just take the component as arranged. Listen, Sonny, this is gonna be so much easier on everybody if you just give me that component. Darling, the only thing you're taking from here is my heart. But it will mend in time. I'm sorry, all right? I'm, I, I didn't think I'd get caught. You didn't think about a lot of things. How's Hank? We're still running. The house is gone, so is our freedom. How do you think he is? I'm sorry. I know you're mad. I'm not looking for an apology, Scott. The only reason why we're even talking is because we need what's in your head. How big did you get? My record? 21 feet. Not bad. You? I don't... No, really, I'm curious. 65 feet. Whoa. Yeah. Huge. 65. If you two are finished comparing sizes, we need to figure out a way to track down the lab. Look at us teaming up twice in one day. Makes you think, huh? About what? Germany. What do you mean? We were working together, training together, and you know, other stuffing together. If I'd asked you, would you have come? I guess we'll never know. But I do know one thing. What? If I had, you'd have never been caught. Oh, no. Really? 
This guy again. Who? I told you our business wasn't over. 